If you own a camera like this, or any other action camera with a gyroscope, even a Sony camera, then this video is for you. Don't you just hate it when you go out to film action stuff with your action camera and it looks like this? This is footage from a recent trip on the Hagyang Loop where I put the GoPro on a handlebar of my bike with a clamp and it looked very bad and very shaky. I could see the camera shaking while driving, but there is a way to fix it. And it's free, totally free. And it works like magic. All you have to do is download GyroFlow. I put the link right here. You see that? Right there. That's where I put it. And you just download that and install it and everything and you just pop your footage in there and it works like magic. Very easy, you can change the export settings, whatever you want to do. And you can even just pop your footage in there and hit export and it works. You don't have to do anything. You don't have to be a magician. You don't have to be a engineer or anything. Just pop it in there, hit exports and it does its work and if and it works. The only thing I would recommend changing is going from ProRes to H.264 or H.265 because the ProRes files are approximately a thousand times bigger than the original files. I'm not just, I'm, I'm not even kidding. But yeah, change that and you're good to go. Hit the export. Another good thing is that after a little while, I parked the bike. So I don't need all this footage stabilized because it's just me moving the bike and parking it another place and everything so instead of having all this like all of this stabilized i'll just go to the end here stop there and hit this trim end and now it will only stabilize this part if you want to you can even if you want to do use this on social media you can put in uh, the vertical oh sorry wrong resolution you can put in 1080 1920 and you get a vertical resolution and it will still stabilize the footage when you have decided on all the parameters i wouldn't go too much into the advanced tab or whatever i just like to leave all of this to the gyroflow app because it's so good with, with gopro footage then just hit exports and it will export yeah i've already exported this file but i can hit yes and then see it works fast but that is all dependent on your laptop computer whatever you use but it's fairly quick and it's better than stabilizing in post in your software or in like Premiere Pro or DaVinci Resolve or whatever because this app is using the gyroflow data and your editing software DaVinci Resolve or Premiere Pro or whatever isn't so yeah and then it's done and it looks like this. The only thing you have to remember when you go out filming your action stuff with your action camera is that you leave off hyper smooth or mega stability or whatever you call it on these cameras these days because that doesn't work as well as fixing it in post. We're not even... We're not supposed to fix it in post, are we? We're supposed to fix it in camera, but don't do it this time. Please don't. So, okay. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.